Hello everyone, my name is Shark, and welcome to No Strings Attached. This game is also made by Zed Technician. Same guy who made Man from the Window, Man from the Window 2, The Warning Watch, and The Fish's Tail, which I've all played. You know what? I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a playlist on my channel. Uh, games by Zed Technician because I really really like his games. They're really fun. Most of them are free and the ones that aren't free They're really cheap. They're like one dollar. So it's a really good price honestly And so I do pay for every one of them just because I really like his content So I do give money because on the website you can it's name your price so you can go free or as much as you want uh, some of them, though, the minimum is a dollar, which is like Man from the Window 2 is a, a, a dollar, um, but that's really it. Uh, I think there's one more that's a dollar, which I haven't played yet, but I'm going to. But yeah, I know nothing about the game. I, I obviously, everyone knows this, I do not read what the game is about because I like to be surprised. So let's get started. All right. Here we go. Okay. Hello, Mrs. Granny Gran. Hey, wait a minute. Isn't that the woman from, from the fish's tail? <laughs> Don't you? She fell. I want to turn the volume up a little. Oh no, it's not. She's got three eyes. What the heck? She's not, a cyclops has one eye. What is it? What's it? We're gonna look up on Google. What's it called when someone's got three eyes? According to history from below, the sixth century CE writer John Malalas contended that the cyclops in Euripides in fact had three eyes. Huh? Really? Huh? Okay, I guess she's a cyclops? I guess. <laughs> Keep it up and I'll- Oh, shit, I didn't get to read one. The first one. Uh-oh, I was distracted by her eye. Keep it up and I'll put you out on the street. Don't go thinking I won't now. Making all that noise when I'm trying to nap. Who in their right mind? Wait. There ain't no guests in here tonight. Okay, Granny Gran. All right, whoever or whatever in here, you'd better listen up and listen good too. I'm going to bed. You can stay, you can leave. Don't matter to me much to me. Did, did I read that right? I don't think so. That did not sound right. But awake me up again and you're going to have problems. Got it. I don't want to mess with Cyclops, Grandma. I really don't. Open me. What kind of darn fool do you take me for? I ain't opening that. I'm sorry, what? Shoot! Find the clue, then open the gift. I remain... What did you say? Unmade. Okay, uh, find the clue, then open the gift. I re Is it the clue? I remain unmade. Is, oh, that's the door. Okay. It's a broom closet. I, sh I guess, yes it is. Can I not open it? <laughs> okay, can't open it. Oh, is this, is this it? Ooh, I found it right away. They know her grandma. As the intruder closed the distance between himself and Maggie, a single deafening thud reverberated through the night. Then all fell silent once more. Not long after, the intruder was dropped off at the local hospital by Maggie. <laughs> she then casually went on about her business that night. <laughs> well, sorry, what? The man had been knocked <laughs> into a state of stone-cold unconsciousness <laughs> after being plunged by her cane. <laughs> Despite her best efforts, the doctor was unable to wake him, and after many, many attempts, the man didn't awaken until long after Christmas. <laughs> so fucking mad, you just destroyed him. <laughs> fucking, oh, I'm gonna get- That reminds me of that one case where this husband and wife were gonna get a divorce, and the, the husband wanted everything. So, so, the- the- the, the wife was a nurse, right? I think you might have heard of this. Uh, so she's trained in a self-defense. Um, so he hired a hitman to kill her. She ended up killing him. There's a whole story about it. You can probably find it on YouTube. Look up nurse. Just look up nurse kills assassin. You, you'll probably find it. 
that's that kind of what reminds me hey post editing me here uh that thing i just talked about it is true i'm not lying but i literally just found out that that happened maybe a mile away uh, from where i live like right now which is really funny like it happened in portland oregon i don't live in portland oregon i do live in oregon and i do live kind of close to it but it's not in portland oregon but it's like maybe a mile or two or three it's not that far there's a bunch of videos on youtube about it i will put one in the description for a six minute video it's short i just think it's really fascinating and i think it's really weird that it happened really close to where i am without me even noticing until right now as editing this video of that but is that the whole game there's so many other rooms. No, it can't be. It can't, it can't be. It can't be it. Maybe it's something in another room. Oh, yeah. See, there's different boxes. Wrong one. Oh, do it's. Oh, do I have to find a specific box? Is there one box in each room? Okay. It's the same one, isn't it? Yep. Same dialogue. Okay, so there might be a different box in each room. <laughs> I just think it's so funny. <laughs> Fucking. <sighs> All right. Okay, what's is this the clue? I'm guessing this is the clue. Victim C. Oh wait, what does it change? Victim C. Okay. C is the third letter in the alphabet, and if these are Roman numerals, three would be this one. There's three oranges, so this this might be it. Shower. Hello, Grandma! <laughs> All right, is this it? Oh, it is! But hurry, for at midnight I will come to find you. Eight missing legs. Eight missing legs. Uh, if we're going by ruin numerals again, uh, that's two. That's one. Uh, three, four, eight is a V, and then three uh, eyes. So that's this one, right? Yeah, that's that's eight. Dang! I thought I was being smart there. That is eight, right? In Roman numerals, that's eight. Maybe the I just got lucky with the Roman numeral guess, but it could be like eight missing legs. Maybe in one room, there's like a table and chairs missing or whatnot. So, okay, let's see. Lost signal. Lost signal. I'm, I'm guessing one of the rooms has no signal on the TV. I can't turn the TV on. So... Uh, one of the TVs might have, might be on. One of the TVs might be on and it has no signal, it says no signal. Mmm, bread. Right, that's the TV. I have till midnight, it said. So, ah, this one. I'm guessing, right? Yes. Okay, I'm getting the hang of it. Losing track of time. Okay, uh, I'm guessing one of the clocks isn't working. What about that one? Nope. 11.08. Oh, 11.09, but again, I could have just switched while I was looking, so. 11.11? What? That one. Good. Victim C. Oh, okay, that's room C. That's room C. Which, no, that's actually back here. That's back here. Right? That's two. Wait, no, wait. That one, two. This is three. Yes, this is three. Oh, right, I opened the door already. Right, that was last game. Ah! Oh! But no, that that was what? That, you know what I just from? I just noticed I'm reading it wrong. It's not victim C. It's vitamin C. My brain, my dyslexic brain, just kicked in. It's like you dumb dumb. It's vitamin C, not victim C. <laughs> the only reason I got it right last time is because the third, the room three, 
had oranges in it, which have vitamin C. Okay, I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay, I get it. So the so there's the room. There's hints in the rooms. Got it. Lost signal. Okay, that's the one with uh, with the TV. But the TV might switch rooms. I think so. I have to look in every single room. Wait. This one. Okay, if the clock one is this one. Uh, so let's remember that it is. Uh. Nine. Wait, no, nine. No. Yeah, nine. Room nine. Room nine is the clock one. Okay, here we go. Okay. I remain unmade. I'm gonna guess it's a bed, because that's the only thing in here that could be made. Ah, here we go. This one. Right, this has got to be it, right? It's dark outside. Okay, I'm gonna guess one of the rooms. Uh, one of the rooms, the windows open. Okay, if I looked in it, I'm gonna close the door, so we can weave out uh, any of the the non-believers. If you know what I'm saying, no, seriously, uh, not non-believers. Okay, we're not we're not getting religious up in here. I try, I try to keep my channel uh, distracted from all that. Um, so, okay. Unmade. Uh, no, 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 no. Uh, dark outside. This one has a candle. That could be it. Okay, I'm looking around still. And if uh, one of the windows isn't open, I'll go for candle. Ah, this one. I was correct. Okay. Losing track of time. Losing track of time. Oh, the, the clock one. Right, right, right. It was in room nine. I remember that one. Right? Yes. Eight missing legs. This one ain't gonna... I'm guessing there's two chairs gone. All right. This one. See? Haha. -ha. The best thing since... Sliced bread. Sliced bread. And I know where the bread is. Down here, right? This one... No, not this one. Uh, this one... Yeah. This one. Burn it. Burn it at both ends. Burn it at both ends. Could that be the candle? Because you... But you only burn the top. That's the vitamin C one. I have no... Oh, this one has no microwave. Oh, it could be that one. Burn at both ends. <sighs> okay, I'm taking a risk with the candle. Wait, this is the vitamin C room. I'm taking the risk with the candle. Taking the risk with the candle. A second box. That's the vitamin C one. Could it be the microwave one? Taking a guess. Damn it! <sighs> okay, so I think the ending's always the same unless I beat it. Okay, let's do this again. I'm gonna speed run and I think, oh, not speed run, you know, time lapse it until I get to where I was, which is when the, the rooms turn red. Unheated food, that's the microwave. <music> I think this is it, right? Yeah. Okay, so the... Okay, yeah. Okay, got it, got it. Because the candle means... Oh, it's almost over. It remains unmade. The bed. Oh, wait. I can't... I got to close the door. Just so I know... Uh, where I've been. Okay. Unmade bed. This one. 
a second box. I know where that one is. I figured it out uh, right when the time lapse started. It's uh, all the way over here. There's literally just a big box uh, with the regular box. Uh, I think it's this one right here, right? Yeah, see, there's a box right there. Seven years of bad luck. Seven years of bad luck? Salt? No, sorry, mirror? Salt's, I think, three years, right? Of a mirror. Oh, the bathroom! I haven't looked in the bathroom yet. I mean, I looked in once, but I didn't know anything I had to do with it. This one's no signal. So this one must be the bathroom. Right? <gasps> what was that? Why am I scared? Granny gonna kill it. Lost signal. And that's this one. All right. Open the closet. The broom closet. Oh, there's the light. The light shines upon me. And I will be saved. Bruh. I've got you now. I... Hey, wait a minute. You're not Jimmy. What? You're not Jimmy. He is supposed to be here and you're not him. He lives right here at 1989. I read that completely wrong. Nine, 9189 Zora Lane. But this is 6816 Zora Lane. Crap, I'm at the wrong house. Boy, you better start explaining what in the heck's going on here before I decide to knock you upside the head. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I live down the down the moon water commune with my brother and sisters. Yesterday this guy showed up and he's all like, I want to cut this tree down and take it home to use for decoration. I know I, I butchered that, sorry. And we tell him, no, that's one of our sacred trees. Don't take that one. But then he starts chopping it down anyway. And I'm there, you know, I'm 100% ready to start throwing punches, right? Then, then and there. But then the Grand Elder shows up and goes, no, Philip, you mustn't do that. So I wait until everyone left and then track that guy down. Turns out his name's Jimmy. My plan was to just scare him a little bit. You know, I wasn't going to hurt him or anything. But then I went to the wrong address. So yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, I got to go find Jimmy now. Are you crazy or something? You can't go do that, huh? You can't just go barging into folks' home, boy. You could get hurt or worse. But what about Jimmy? Forget about him. I know you're too young and headstrong and stupid to realize it now. But you can't just take matters into your own hands like that. There's a right way to go about these things, and then there's a wrong way, too. I shouldn't have to tell you that breaking and entering definitely ain't the right way, but enough of that. I've had enough of dealing with you and your nonsense for tonight. So get lost and let me sleep in peace. And don't let me catch you doing something like stupid like this again, so you hear? Okay, thanks, miss. My oh, I read the most of that without messing up. My brain is going through like a, a an endorphin fucking. <laughs> that almost never happens. Woo! I did it! Yeah! Let's go! Okay. Is there a hard mode in this one? I don't think so. There's not. Okay, but I do want to see what happens if you. If you wait too long, because he says you have till midnight, right? So I'm guessing you have, I want to say 10 minutes or whatever. whatever. So I'm just going to watch the clock. I'm just going to do shit on my phone and, and we'll wait. <laughs> All right, here we go. Time's almost up. Oh, a couple seconds. Here we go. Midnight time. Oh. 
that took a lot longer than I than I uh, than I thought it would. I'll put a timer on the screen right now, just to tell you how long it actually took. Uh, because I actually don't know. <laughs> Once the clock had finally struck midnight, the front door suddenly began to open. Oh, it's Philip. The intruder slowly made his way down the hallway, intently searching for the building single occupant. His search has cut short, however, when a single defining thud rang through the night. Soon afterward, the intruder was dropped off to the local. Oh, okay, it's just gonna be the same stuff as before. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So, so no matter what we win, fucking you know, Maggie, dude, Grandma, man, Grandma, she, 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 she balling, dude, fucking. But yeah, that was no strings attached. I hope you guys enjoyed. That was so silly. That was that was hilarious. I kind of want to put this in the scary games, uh, playlist, right? Because, uh, Zed Technician does scary game, but it wasn't really a scary game. It was more funny. I'll have to debate it. Um, but yeah, if it is, then it is. And if it's not, then it's in the Zed Technician playlist. Because I'm going to make that when this is being uploaded. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please subscribe. It really helps my channel. Peace! I should also mention the link for the game is in the description.